On the 27th of May, my granddad, 73, and my nan, 71, were the victims of a serious car crash um, as a result of someone making a dangerous U-turn on the Hale Bypass. It resulted in very serious injuries. Their car caught on fire and they were trapped inside, but luckily kind and brave members of the public stopped and pulled them out through the boot. Uh, my granddad has two broken vertebrae in his neck, a broken bone in his back, broken sternum, feet, fingers, you know, the list goes on. He's going to Derriford next week for further treatment. And my nan also suffered with broken ribs and um, a broken hip bone, and they're suffering with vivid flashbacks also so it was just a horrific crash there's no u-turn signs all along this road but clearly these signs aren't enough there's been a number of deaths on this road and a number of really horrific accidents and unfortunately with the summer coming up i fear that it's only going to get worse and i fear that we're not the only family who are going to be dealing with something like this Petitions had a really massive response and a really, really positive response. I was overwhelmed and just really, really happy about it. I have um, spoken to our local councillors and put it forward to the relevant people, so I'm hoping that Cornwall Council will act upon this request. I don't see how, you know, you can ignore the public now. Enough's enough and we just need to make this road safe and I think a barrier is the only way to do this. I understand it's going to be expensive, but when people are losing their lives, it's a small price to pay.